Hi everyone, it's Anne from Anne Ellis Angels and here are your angel card readings for the coming week. These are general readings, so take from them everything that resonates with you. Leave behind anything else, but most importantly, enjoy the readings and have a really positive week. So Cancer, or Moon Child, as we sometimes refer to you, let's have a look at your cards here for the week, starting the 31st of October. And the first row here are from the Teacup Tarot, and the second row are from the Time to Shine deck. So your overall energy here is the card, the Knight of Pencils. And this is quite a quick energy coming in for you. And the Knight brings along the message for you to choose with care. This card says that you might have more than one choice to make and it's very important that you check them both out before deciding. In they come charging in on the motorbike and the choices are the wide, well-marked main road or the bumpy potholy track. This lovely angel on the motorbike needs to choose carefully. So that's lovely mindfulness for you this week. The five of thought comes in and says, time to move in a new direction. Here we have you on the motorbike, move in a good direction. This is about making new plans, learning from experience, learning things that didn't work sometimes is as helpful as just learning what did work. So take all your experience, all your little pearls of wisdom with you and get ready to move in this new direction. Your help or your hurdle. The Ace of Pencils brings in new ideas, new clarity. This card says, try different new ideas, try different ways of moving forward. And you will find the way that works. That's just what the angels done look she missed with the first few attempts at hitting the target, but now she's hit the bullseye because she's learned how to do it. She's got the clarity and the new ideas. She's put them all together and now she can hit the bullseye every time. So keep going. Make this new plan. Go forward with things that you know are working well for you. The Ten of Life comes in and says this is the card of peace of mind, quality family time with other people. This is the card of financial security as well. Your guidance here, we have the card 11, Strength. And this card says, use kindness when you deal with others and be gently and kindly assertive and stand up for yourself. And as if to remind you to do exactly that, the seven of action card comes in and says, stand up for yourself and think your choices through with care. So very much a week where you need to be assertive. You need to make sure that you are heard and that you very politely and kindly get your point across. How can we help ourselves? In comes New Beginnings card. This is a card of transformation. New chapters opening up, a new start for you, a beautiful new beginning. And the Four of Emotion says, look out for this new beginning by standing back and paying attention. Look right round. Don't just look in one direction. Step back. Look right round. Look at the whole picture. That's where this news is going to come from. These are where you can find the new beginnings, not necessarily in the direction you were expecting. When you've found this new beginning and start to act upon it, the high priestess comes in and says, think it all through. When this lovely new opportunity arrives, just take your time, pause, sit down, have a cup of tea, Take your time. Do the research. Make sure it's what you really want to do, not just what you think you ought to do. So think this through really carefully and then be ready to make your choice. Once you've got all your information, your choice will be much simpler. So when you've made your decision, 
in comes the Knight of Coins. Now, you've had two knights all in one reading. And the Knight of Coins is about detailed and careful planning. Now, we were talking about thinking it through, doing the research. Here's the plan, but it's a detailed plan. And it's plan A, plan B and plan C if you need it. So that once you've got that in place, like our angel on the card here, when she hops back on that motorbike, she knows not only where she's going, she knows exactly how she's going to get there and progress will be quick and progress will be easy because she'll know exactly what she's doing. That's just what you need to be focusing on this week. And stay determined, stay motivated. If things don't work out first time, don't worry. Focus on self-belief and self-support. So what a lovely reading for you this week. Choices and decisions to be made. Think them all through very carefully and take your time. Try new ideas, try different things and learn what hasn't worked and take forward with you what has worked. Stand up for yourself, be gently and kindly assertive and then stand back. Here's your new beginning. Here's the wonderful new chapter. Think it through, do the research, make your plan and then be ready. Keep going, stay motivated because it will be here soon enough. Make your plan and you'll be at your goal before you know it. Just by following the simple steps that you've put in place already. So I hope you've enjoyed the reading. If you have, click that subscribe button. It's fantastic when you do. Thank you for doing that. And then you'll get notified when I do the next one for you. So take care now and I'll see you soon.